In 1939, this apartment in Paris was locked up and abandoned by its owner. Seventy years later, it was reopened. Inside, they found a stunning interior from that time and rare art pieces worth several million dollars. Only later did they discover who the apartment truly belonged to. Many years ago, in 1939, 23-year-old Madame de Florian had to make the difficult decision to leave her luxurious 140-square-meter apartment located on the right bank of the Seine in Paris, near the Opéra Garnier in the 9th arrondissement. This was the beginning of World War II, and her departure may have been linked to the news that German soldiers were advancing towards Paris. She clearly left the city in a hurry, taking only the essentials and leaving many personal items and pieces of furniture behind in the apartment. She locked the apartment and headed south to a safer free zone. For all those years, she continued paying rent for the apartment, but never returned and never visited Paris again. In 2010, the woman passed away at the age of 91. It was only after her death that the heirs learned about the apartment. They hired auctioneer Olivier Panetto Vry to assess the property inside the apartment. Many antique pieces of furniture, books, paintings, and other items had been left behind. Considering that many years had passed since the apartment was sealed, the auctioneer and his team were extremely excited until the moment they inserted the key into the lock and opened the doors. When the team entered the apartment, they were all breathless with astonishment. Everything around seemed frozen in time, as if they had stepped into the past. The air was filled with dust and cobwebs were everywhere. Furniture from the early 1900s turned out to be a real treasure. The dining room was fully set with all the necessary dishes and other items. Paintings had been taken down from the walls, as though the owner had planned to take them later, but had evidently been unable to. On an old dressing table lay her personal belongings, brushes, bottles of perfume and cosmetics, various boxes, and an alarm clock. Everything looked as though she had just stepped out for a moment and was about to return at any time. In one corner was a large toy Mickey Mouse and a Porky Pig, However, one of the most remarkable finds was a painting of a woman in a pink dress. Further investigation revealed that it was a portrait of the previous owner of the apartment and the grandmother of Madame de Florian, Marta de Florian. The painting turned out to be the most valuable item in the apartment. According to experts, the painting was created by renowned Italian artist Giovanni Boldini. As it was later discovered, Marta de Florian was a famous French actress and socialite of the 1880s. She led a lavish life and had many admirers among prominent men, including artists, several prime ministers, and the president of France. Later, a love letter from Giovanni Boldini was also found, explaining why he had decided to paint her portrait. The painting was created in 1888, when Marta was 24 years old. After its discovery in 2010, it was sold at auction for $3.4 million, becoming the most expensive painting ever sold by the artist. Madame de Florian's heirs understood why she might have left the apartment in such a hurry at the time, but many questions still remain. For example, what prevented her from returning later? And why did she continue to pay rent for 70 years while keeping the existence of the apartment a secret from her relatives? It seems that no one will be able to answer these questions anymore. All we can do is marvel at the untouched by time discoveries. The apartment is closed to the public and it is currently impossible to visit it. Its estimated value is now 10 million euros. The story of the Paris apartment forgotten for 70 years was so captivating that several writers immediately penned novels based on these events. Each of them became a bestseller. Thank you so much for watching this video to the end. Don't hesitate to share your thoughts in the comments 